In this video, I'm going to explain how an obstacle in the river can form an eddy. Um, this is a top-down view of the river, and the arrows there represent how, how the water is flowing. So as the water approaches the rock, it's all in a straight line called laminar flow. Uh, so this means it's all just flowing evenly um, from top to bottom. So when the water hits the rock, it piles up into what's called a pillow. You can see the arrows are all just kind of getting stuck on top of each other, and the water is actually forming a little bit of a mound around the rock there. So when the water passes by the rock, there's a negative pressure behind it, which pulls some of the water into that space. Now the water will actually flow backward upstream to fill in that space behind the rock. And this water will continue circling around, um, and that's what forms the eddy, is that circular flow behind the rock. The rest of the water will just continue normally downstream until it hits another obstacle. So we'll just watch that whole thing again from the beginning. So the water hits the rock and piles up into the pillow, and then as it passes by, some of that water gets sucked into the eddy, and it just gets circled around and around.